Uh, Nana tells me Artemis would still feel joy at the things they experience. But if they should learn of their fate, that they were alone, no longer real, unable to meet their friends, such knowledge may cause them great pain. You must choose. Upload them to machine to sub-simulation where they may live on or help Artemis. I, why do I have to decide this? Welcome back, everybody, to No Man's Sky. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are going to do two. We have two major tasks. We're going to go to the anomaly, uh, get the Atlas Pass three, uh, version three, and then we are going to go to the space station, and we're going to get um, uh, we're going to get the thingamadoodle that we need to go do a derelict freighter. Oh, also, we're going to take a look at some of the Quicksilver stuff too. We have 300 Quicksilver that. I haven't done any anomaly emissions, so I think we probably just got those from doing the storyline, and maybe uh, see if we can, you know, get some get some spiffed up uh, stuff or something. I don't know. We'll see. So anyway, let's see. We can let's just go. Let's go ahead and do the space station first, I suppose. Um, so we'll just go to the station in uh, this system here. I don't think it really matters which one we go to for what I am intending to do. Alright, so we want to talk to the junk dealer dude, who is over here. Get up there. There you go. Okay. And what we have to do from this guy is we have to purchase for 5 million credits this thing here. And that gives us an emergency signal scanner, and then with that we can... Oh, I'm stuck. Uh, with that we can do the... Uh, this thing reset? Yes, it has. Look at that. Derelict freighter. Okay, so we got that done. Why can't I loot that? I don't know. Alright, let's go over here. Quick look at some of these ships down here. Um, I have two wingmen, so I'm still on the lookout for two more. But preferably, I'd like those wingmen to be fighters. Uh, let's just take a quick look at this real quick. So, um, mm, no, we'll stay. We'll stay the anomaly race. Look at the body shape, the head, um, helmet. That's cool. How do I, how do I unlock these other helmets? That's weird. Oh, that's kind of weird. It's got a bit of an Iron Giant vibe to it. That's kind of cool. No, that's what we're wearing right now. Mm, that's not too bad. Okay, I think I like this one. I, I like this one. Let's go with that. Okay, so now we've got a new helmet look. Um, as far as torso goes, let's stick with what we have for that. Uh, for armor. I like, nope, I like what we have for that. Gloves. Definitely like what we have for that too. Legs. That's kind of cool. Wait a minute. Hold on. No. No! Don't kick me out of the whole thing, dummy. Legs. Okay. Um. Change cam. Rotate. Oh, there we go. Rotate camera. Okay. Hmm. Okay. I sort of kind of like these because they give us, like, armor. Not so sure I like the boots, but we can change the boots. No, I don't like that. So it would either be between three... I mean, two's not bad either, really. It's got, like, knee pads. That's got knee pads. Um, 
I mean, it gives us armor, but eh, I don't know. That's I kind of like this, actually. I mean, this is what we have right now. Yeah, let's go with those. Okay, and then boots. Those kind of have, like, shin guards on them. Ooh, those are kind of cool looking. No, I don't like those. That's what we have now. I, I like the shins, but I don't like the, f the footwear. So let's go with these. Okay. Backpack. Um, oh, we don't have any options for backpack. Just That's all we can do. Okay. And then banner. Yeah, who cares about that? All right, well, we changed a couple of things, so that's cool. Save changes. Just kind of changing things up a little bit here. All right, now we are going to go to the anomaly next. What are you? You are a level B fighter. And not really interested in the rest of you guys. Okay. Incoming message. Uh-oh. Our fleet has been involved in a serious incident sustaining heavy damage. Please inspect the damage board. I require your advice. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Yeah, we better recall the frigate. Okay. Because um, I don't want to lose it. And, um... Man, everybody's warping in as soon as we come out of the space station. Tempted to look for. Wait, where the hell are they all at? We need some more um, trader trader brickets. These are all over here. Let's just take a very quick look over here. I'm not going to spend a ton of time doing this. Nah, I think that's a combat. I, I don't really want to get any more frigates until we can. Uh, uh, well, I want to prioritize trader frigates. I guess is what I'm trying to say. Okay, so, um, yeah, let's call the anomaly. Actually, I'm going to call it uh, close to the freighter, so let's go to the freighter first. There we go. Uh, this is our dude that needs some attention. Oh, yeah, and that is our one and only trader frigate. We certainly don't want to lose that. Okay, let's just go get this guy fixed up real quick. Okay, so that should take care of this ship. However, are we going to be able to launch from here? No, it doesn't let us relaunch from here. Collect units? Alright, I don't know how many units I collected because it didn't show me. I guess we need to go back to the, the freighter first, which is fine. You know, I'm not so sure I'm... I like the the visor, but I'm not so sure I'm digging the, the cat ears on this. Hmm, I don't know, we'll see. Oh, you know what? Before we take off for the next thing, let's do a quick save here. Let's do a manual save. Alright, where is our shipperuski? Yeah, I do have um, the salvage data thingies with me. Yes, I do. Okay. Now, I know I've heard before that the, um, the Atlas Passes are really not that great, but I've never gotten anything more than a level one, so we're just going to do it so that way we can say we did it. You know? If we don't like it, then we'll know for future reference. I know that the level one is, you know, isn't really anything to write home to mother about, but we'll see how it goes. And you know what? I haven't actually been to the anomaly for a while, so let's see if we have stuff we can turn in and get some more nanites. Wow, 
my goodness, 905 nanites. That is good. No 250 from that dude. Okay. All right, let's run over here and uh, where do we get the Atlas Pass from? Is it, is it here? Can't move. I don't remember. I, I think it's here. Let's see here. Got all the storage. Primitive shapes, alloy roofing, alloy wall, stone roofing. You know, at some point I'm just going to do a massive farming sesh of salvage data so we can start unlocking some more of this stuff. I mean, I know we can unlock some, maybe even eventually all of it by continuing the base quest, but I mean, that takes a long time to do all that stuff, so. Uh, those are lights, spark plugs. No, maybe that was... We must get the Atlas Pass to somewhere else. Okay. Oh. You guys were telling me that I... There's a mission that I can do that'll get me the Minotaur, which I want to get next. So... I mean, it's only 10... I don't know. We'll see. I, I, I don't remember what mission you said I needed to do. Maybe, it, maybe it's the... Um, the settlement thingy that we got to do. Here we go. This is the Atlas Pass. Okay. Oh, this is Nanites. This isn't even salvage data. Okay, even better. Um, and oh, this is the warp hypercore thingy. Uh, that's yeah. You know what? We got a crap ton of Nanites. Let's just get all this stuff here. Okay, so that's Emerald, 200 Emerald, and one microprocessor. That'll be easy peasy, lemon squeezy to make. Okay, so we've learned everything here. Very cool. Um. I guess that's it, right? That I wanted to do here? Oh no, I wanted to look at the Quicksilver stuff. Oh, and I, looks like we need to talk to, uh, what's a, whatchamacallit? This dude, Entity Nada. What do you got to say? All observed your signal approach, but it was anomalous. The signature was from the wrong time. Are you well? Not incomplete? Not fading? How does visor light flares burning with concern and distress? Oh, that's right. We gotta take the mind dark to this guy. Okay, you know what? I wasn't planning on doing story stuff, but let's do it since we're here. I tell not about Artemis, about Noel, and about the mind dark. It glows brightly as I reveal it. So, if you guys didn't remember, if, I don't know, three, four episodes back, we met another, I guess, traveler whose name turns out to be Noel, and then we learned this thing called the mind dark, and we used it to copy. Um, basically copy Artemis. So we have a copy of Artemis's the entity <laughs> inside this mind dark thing. Okay. It is Echo. I I never thought to see a traveler soul. You are so beautiful. Okay. Maybe he likes my cat ears on my new helmet. Uh, but friend entity, this Artemis Echo is in pain, disconnected. This arc is no rescue. Um okay. So what do I need to do? Artemis Echo will never have body again. We'll never explore again. Old life gone. But we can help them. Nada has a machine. No, not a machine. It is something living. A refuge. There is a choice. You may upload Artemis Echo to machine, to sub-simulation, where they may live on, or help Artemis Echo end suffering. Um. Okay, so let me think about this. We can upload Artemis's copy to a machine, and then they basically live on in the machine. Okay, or we end suffering, which kind of implies, you know, that we kill it, kill him, it, her, whatever. I don't even know if Artemis is a male or female, or maybe neither, or maybe both. Who knows? Uh, yeah. Is there another way about this? Nada shakes her head strangely, trying to adopt my own mannerisms. The gesture is appreciated, if disconcerting. Hmm. You must choose. Upload them to machine to sub-simulation where they may live on or help Artemi Artemis Echo in suffering. I mean, how in the heck am I supposed to know <laughs> what, what Artemis wants? 
Um, all right, tell me more about the simulation. I ask what life would be like inside of this simulation. Nada pauses for a moment, staring at me strangely. How the heck am I supposed to know that he's staring at me strangely? I mean, come on, really. Uh, Nada tells me Artemis would still feel joy at the things they experience. But if they should learn of their fate, that they were alone, no longer real, unable to meet their friends, such knowledge may cause them great pain. You must choose. Upload them to machine, to sub-simulation, where they may live on, or help Artemis. I, why do I have to decide this? Um... Okay, I guess I've decided. Go and speak with Polo Traveler. They will help you calibrate the machines, no matter what your decision. Whatever you do, I'm proud of your compassion. You are, you are a traveler friend. Okay. Um, if you say so. Specialist Polo. Nada told me what you need to do. Just know, friend, we, that we support you, no matter the choice. Okay? I will prepare the machine. It is not a friend's private refuge. Please treat it with care. Okay. See, the thing is, is... Decide Artemis is fated not as private terminal. Where's not as private terminal? Uh, is that what this thing is? Oh no, it's showing me to go over here. I mean, I want I want to do for Artemis what Artemis would want me to do for them, and I have no idea what that is. I mean, for Pete's sake. Okay. Um. I guess it's over here. Here's what I'm thinking, okay? So, wow, I've never been in here before. Um, if I if I load Artemis's conscience, or not even, I mean Artemis's copy, what's that noise? Into this machine, it seems to me that Artemis will then be able to at least. Uh, be cognizant enough to decide what happens from there. If the alternative is that I decide that they end their suffering, which implies that I decide they die. And, you know, I, I can't have that on my conscience. I'm sorry. I just can't. So, yeah. Okay, here what we're going to do. Terminal Prime. Okay, the machine is ancient and powerful, a relic of a world long since destroyed. The craft is extraordinary. It is clearly tended too often and with great love. I feel a whisper, not as faint hum over the speaker. As they commune with the machine, the words on panel unscramble themselves. Not an entity authorization detected. Secondary simulation re, uh, right enabled. This relic is a simulation of a solar system, a prayer offered by ancient Corvax to the Atlas, now reshaped to the heart of the anomaly. Hmm. A single false solar system so dear to Nada, it will act as a home for Artemis should I wish it. Yeah, see, allow Artemis to die. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna upload them, and if they get pissed at me for uploading them instead of letting them die, I mean, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. <laughs> I upload Artemis to the simulation. A spark of blue light blazing through air, uh, the air before me. It fades after a moment, disappearing at the depths of the machine. Well, there's Artemis. Leave. Nada tells me that it is done. For my sake, they will permit transmissions to and from this simulation. At least while the anomaly passes through safe systems. Okay. They warn me that Artemis will need some time to grow adjusted to their new life. Um. I hope you're down with this. Because, you know, the alternative was you die. Okay. So, there you go. And by the way, you suck for putting me in this position in the first place. <laughs> anyway. That was kind of cool, actually. Now speak with Nada Polo if you wish. If you wish, return to space when ready to continue. Change active mission in the log. Oh, so does that end that whole entire quest line? Artemis's fate has been sealed. I can only hope I have done the right thing. It is time to find Apollo and see what sense I can make of this situation. Interesting. Okay. Very cool. All right. Yeah, I, like I said, I wasn't expecting to do storyline stuff in this episode, but we did some storyline stuff. And we made a decision, and hopefully it was the right decision. 
Um, what are we doing? We we're, we're gonna go. We're gonna go do a derelict freighter. That's what we're gonna do. Uh, I guess we don't have to talk to these dudes anymore. Oh boy, that was stressful. Poor <laughs> Artemis. All right. No, oh, Apollo's trying to get a hold of us. All right, let's see what he wants. Kazit, you are Kazit receiving. The hollow terminus is showing Kazit available again. Your signal was Kazit. Thought you were gone. It is a relief to hear Apollo again. It feels like we have not spoken in a long time. Explain. I try to recount the experience of Apollo as best as I can. The gateway, the strange planet, a vast machine, the crimson orb. As I talk, I realize the memories themselves are unstable, that I cannot form them in my mind. It's just a dull, aching red. I tell Apollo that I think I saw the atlas itself. You. You saw it? You met the atlas? The Gek, the Corvax, they worship it as a god. I never thought it was real. Never thought. Are you all right? I can't imagine what you've gone through. Um, say it was terrifying, say it was just a machine, say it was not a god. Um, well, we did kind of scream when it happened, so yeah, we'll say it was terrifying. I tell Apollo the things the atlas said, how it spoke of travelers and sentinels as if we were protocols, not living things. The way it views us, the way it looked at me. I felt as it, if life and death were just fragile dreams, not real concepts at all. At least it didn't harm you. And I think I think there's something in what you've just said. The Corvax pay homage to the Sentinels precisely because they believe them to be servants of this atlas. We should investigate further. This machine will lead us to the Sentinel Nest. We'll be rich before we know it. Say talk of money is absurd. Say there are more important things. Agree. Um, uh... I don't know. Uh, let's just agree with him. Sure. I like money. I tell Apollo I agree. Perhaps the Sentinels and the Atlas are linked. Perhaps this is the path we need to take. Excuse me. But there are other factors now in play. I tell Apollo of Artemis' grave and my encounter with the mysterious traveler, Null. Artemis is dead? I... I don't know. I, I don't. I mean... How? Who would Kazit? I know I made fun of them, but that was easy. They cared. They believed, and I... Kazit. What's happened to them? Where have you buried Artemis? I want to say goodbye if I can. Tell them your choice. I tell Apollo that Noel gave me a way of saving Artemis to restore them to a form of life. Apollo was initially excited at the prospect of going to meet Artemis, but I explain the nature of what I did. I tell them that Artemis' soul lives on only within a simulation unable to go beyond. Uh, was, yeah, was that the right thing to do? I don't know. It's a long time before Apollo speaks again. Will they be happy? Um, I just have no idea. I'm gonna be honest. You did the right thing. You tried. Whatever you might be feeling right now, know that you are a good friend. Oh, that makes me feel better. Okay. I have to go through the portal and join you. That much is clear. We just need to figure out the right glyphs, the right address for that world of yours. Find a monolith. Search for the patterns in the data. These things are machines, and we simply need to understand their code. Roger that. Okay, now, can I do, do a derelict freighter now? Is that okay with you? Um... You know what, though? Before we do that, I know I like totally. I just want to see if this is a. You know, I'm I'm looking for a trading vessel. I don't have a trading vessel. All right, where is my where's my ship? Leave me alone. I don't want to talk to anybody right now. Kind of, I'm kind of, I'm, I'm contemplative about the whole Artemis thing. Okay, so, um, I want to make sure that we are well prepared for this upcoming mission. Um, what I know about these frigates, uh, the derelict frigates, is they're very, very cold. So what we want to do is, here, let's just, uh, no, I'm not going to waste a whole battery in it. Okay, let's remove these. We'll store these, and we want to put our cold, uh, cold thingies on. Yeah. So this, that, and the other, and that thingy. Okay. And these all need to be charged. Okay. So we have 165 batteries. Uh, so we sh we should be good to go as far as that goes. And then for our multi-tool, we've got 
uh, the paralysis mortar, plasma launcher, um, and the scatter blaster. Oh, and and also the gamma ray, or not the gamma ray thing, the uh, spitter, pulse spitter. Okay, do we have enough uh, inner exosuit? We've got these. So let's let's make a full stack of these because we're probably going to need them for the combat in there. And oh, I want to make a new Atlas Pass. So Atlas Pass version one. Version three. So we just need to make a microprocessor. I mean, we're not we're not going to need it inside of the the thing, the derelict frigate. Uh, but I just want to make it right now so I don't forget. Okay, and then we should be able to go to the freighter. Go to. How do I get to my inventory? Oh, I think what I have to do is I have to go here. And then I take this and put it in the freighter. And then I can go from the freighter into the miscellaneous... Here, and we'll put that in there. Okay. I mean, I don't even know why I'm hanging on to it, to be honest with you. Because uh, if you have three, then you also have access to one and two. Okay, so we got that done. And, um, oh, shoot, we didn't look at the Quicksilver stuff. God burn it. Well, you know what? If, if we don't get started on this now, we are not going to have time to do it in this episode. So we'll do the Quicksilver stuff later. Um, the only other thing I want to do, because if this still isn't fixed, it's going to crash my game. I'm assuming it is, but let's just do another um, another direct save. So that way, if you know, worst case scenario, we can start from this point again. If it, if if in fact it's not fixed, I'm I'm gonna be really surprised if they haven't fixed that. Okay, here we go. You know what? We're going to look at the Quicksilver stuff real quick. Sorry, but I want to do it. Let's look at these Nexus missions real quick. That gives us Nip Nip Buds, Warp Core, Ion Batteries, Ion Logic, Kill 67 Monstrosities. We have to kill 67 of those bastards and we only get 5 Nip Nip Buds? Well, I guess we had 400 Quicksilver out of the deal. Um, I suppose we could do this at some point, but you know what? Nah, let's not let's not worry about that. Let's just see what we can get with 300 Quicksilver that we currently have. Create exotic items for quick so silver. Collect expedition rewards. Duh, 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 duh. Uh, okay. Yeah. Tentacled cape. Armor. Oh, this shit's expensive. Titan worm cape. That's kind of cool looking. Bite beat poster. Golden Freighter Trail, Antimatter Freighter Trail, Hadal Freighter Trail, Royal Ship Catalog Cluster Worm Hunt, Classic Chair. We need a classic chair in our life. An Atlas Cake. There's a lot of stuff in here. Full sail. Oh, there's okay. There's some stuff we can't afford. Well, just fireworks. I don't care about fireworks. I mean, for the goodness sakes, a myth beacon, experimental summing, result of not as research in, <coughs> into unusual patterns detected in the stores of the Gek. You can press a second. Continue to shift. Do this. Do this. 
I don't know what the hell that does. Okay. Empire Banner. So, it doesn't look like we can afford... Oh, that's kind of neat. Chromatic Starship Trail. Starship Exhaust Override. Titles? Oh look, an Artemis figurine. That's neat. Exosuit backpack. So we can change the way our backpack looks. Oh, we have a filter here. Base building parts, gestures, appearances, other curiosities. Cosmic Megafauna Cape. Titan worm. I like this Titan worm cake. That's cool. It's good. It would take 3,000 quicksilvers. Rounded laser. Unlockable companion accessory. Huh. Okay. I like the. I like the. Some of the caves. I like the starship trails. Blue jet. Oh, you can even change your jetpack trail. That is neat. <laughs> this is cool. Okay. We can look like some of the dudes in the anomaly. Oh, this is nice looking armor. First spawn battle mask. Ooh. Ooh, I like both of these. Okay. So, we, we obviously don't even... You know, have nowhere near enough quicksilver. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. Let's go ahead and take. Oh, it just changed. Eliminate hazardous flora. Um. Okay, how often does this change? Repair kits, holographic analyzer, roots of aggression. All right. Well, let's do this because. Why not? But I don't have to... Do I have to start it right now? Starting multiplayer mission, you're about to begin a challenging multiplayer mission on your own. Other times I mean... Yeah. I don't want to do it with anybody else. I want to do it myself. Okay. But I don't have to, like... This isn't a timed thing, is it? Uh-oh, did somebody just join me? No... Okay, we are getting super sidetracked here. Um... How do I... How do I cancel it? <laughs> I don't know how to cancel it. Um... So somebody joined my group. I don't know how that happened. Oh, it is timed. Okay, no, I don't want to do this. I want out. How do I get out? I don't see an option for deleting it. Maybe if maybe if I just don't select it. Hmm. Okay, whatever. Um Let's go. We are like so majorly getting sidetracked here. Sending me to the mission. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder where in the galaxy we're going to end up. Hmm. Okay, let's go map here. Okay, we're kind of in the southwest. Oh, we're not that far. We're not that far away at all from our normal territory. Not 
far away at all. Okay, so do I have to... Is that... That must be the, the player there. Yeah, it is. Okay. Do we have to, like, team up or something? Or... I've never done this, you guys. Well, that's not true. I probably did do a little bit of this kind of thing a long time ago. Uh, when we were doing some multiplayer in the Beyond update, but... I don't know if I have to join them or not, so... Let's just go over there. We might not get to the salvage... Or, or I mean, the derelict frigate in this episode after all. I didn't know that I was going to be committed to this. I thought I could take it and then do it whenever the heck I wanted to. <laughs> okay, so do the two of us just need to join up and kill a bunch of plants? That is what we have to do, right? Planet requires Pergium hazardous flora. Uh, Alright. So... Oh, so it tells us where to go, huh? I think I've scanned everything on this planet already. Hey, this is a... This is an unknown grave. How'd that happen? Atmosphere... Uh, so very little ammunition apology. Floral infestation, but holds no further clues. I will need to scout to locate the hazard. Okay, so this isn't an unknown great. Well, it is, but I guess it's part of this quest. So now what do we do? We need to go towards... Does it tell us where to go? Or do we just look for... Okay, yeah, follow this. So I guess we have to go this way. I don't know if that if me and that other dude have to stay together or not. There's a hazardous floor right there. All right. So we got him out of the way. Have I scanned this? Yeah, I've scanned everything here. Okay. Over here. Oh, screw off, you stupid symbols. Okay, now where do we go? This way. Up here. Where's that? Oh, right here. Okay. I don't think it wants us to kill those. I think it wants us to kill these. Okay. How many more of these? Are oh, seven out of 14. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Do 
Did we get it? Yeah. Is this dude making me do all the work? <laughs> no, that's bullshit. You shouldn't be able to hit me from that far away. Switch to this. Just because it's fun. Alright, you are. I can't even see you. Oh, there you are. Floral threat eliminated. Mission complete. Yeah, he, he must have been working on some, too, because I think I had a few more than just that left. Let's kill that guy for good measure. Okay, so what do we do? Go back to the anomaly now and turn in? Uh, return the space anomaly. Okay. We can do that. Um, why weren't you summoned? Oh. The color's all weird on this planet, that's why. It looked like it was red when it actually was green. There we go, 400 Quicksilver and a Walker Ring, yay us. Okay, cool. Um, so now, if we go over here. And we do here. Okay, we still, <laughs> we still need like 3,000. Universal Community Research Progress. That's like the community thing, right? I've never really done that before. Appearances. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have to get three thousand quicksilver before we can get these capes. I really like this cape for some reason. This one's kind of neat looking though too. I don't particularly care for that one so much. Okay, well we'll do more of these later. That was kind of fun actually. I mean, completely was not intending to do that, but that's the way it happened. How do I leave? How do I leave like a team here? I don't know. Um, or can I tell them thanks for the help? Yeah, let's do that. Thanks for... whoops. For the help. There we go. Okay, so we told them thank you. Now, how, how do I leave my group? Do I go... Uh, summon vehicles, creatures, utilities... I have no idea. <laughs> There's probably... Uh, let's go to network. Current group. Oh, here we go. Leave group. Okay. There we go. Okay. We're, we've left the group. Okay, well, <laughs> we have done our first Nexus mission. Here's what we're going to do, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we are going to... at least get to the derelict frigate. And... Um, Where did the thing you go? Uh, oh, it's right here. Okay. And we're gonna at least confirm that it's it's fixed, and then what I'll probably have to do is just um in the video and then pick up right where we left off. Uh, otherwise, yeah, this is otherwise this is gonna be a super long video. Uh, but let's see if it's fixed first. We can at least do that before we end the video. Morning game not same before Derek's. Okay, it looks like they have fixed it because it would have crashed by now. 
So that's cool. All right, you guys. Well, here's the thing. Um, we are going to pick up right where we left off in the next episode and do this derelict uh, frigate. So I'm going to basically stop the recording and then start it right back up. And we'll start the next episode. So thanks, everybody, for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and share the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.